Hi, Assalamualaikum. Okay, for this video, I will show you the how to calculate this uh, this question. This one is the question from past year question. Okay, so let's do it together. Okay, first you have to read the description here. The following table shows the money supply for country soda in year 2015. Okay. So the item here is paper money 7,800, coins 1,500, demand deposit in commercial bank 11,500, negotiable certificate issued by commercial banks 20,800, bank negara certificates 5,000. 660 negotiable certificates issued by bank simpanan national 8787 and fixed and saving deposit in other financial institution 14300 okay and then the question is calculate a total fiat money okay to marks money supply m1 m2 and also m3 Okay, let's answer question A. So, for question A, fiat money. You have to remember what is the fiat money. Fiat money is the summation of coins and paper money. So, here, uh, for total fiat money, paper money, 7,800 plus coins, 1,000. 500 so you just add this one this is the total fiat money okay done this one is two marks means that the answer could be one mark the the items is half for each item okay so total we will get two marks here okay this is the question a okay question a for question b money supply m1 so how to calculate m1 m1 is total fiat money Plus demand deposit in commercial bank. You have to remember only demand deposit at or uh, checkable deposit ataupun current deposit, current demand deposit. Uh, so we just tambah kat sini demand deposit in commercial bank. Okay, eleven thousand five hundred. So, kat sini dah dapat dah money supply and one. So, berapa dia dapat? This one and this one. Twenty thousand. 800 so sama juga you will get two marks and could be this one one mark and this one also one mark or could be this one half mark and this one half mark if you uh, do it like this I just uh, look at the final answer if that is correct so I will give you two marks and for C, M1, M2, M2, M2 money supply, uh, any saving and fixed deposit in commercial bank. So here, if you look at negotiables issued by commercial bank, yes, you will include in the M2 
Bank Negara Certificate, also M2. Negotiable Certificate by BSN. BSN, you have to remember BSN is not a commercial bank. BSN is one of development financial institution, considered as other financial institution. So, for negotiable uh, certificate issued by BSN and fixed and saving deposit by other financial institution, yang ni, you kena masukkan dalam M3. Okay. So, let's calculate. To find M2 NCD by commercial banks 2800 Okay Kemudian BNM Certificate uh, For you, you have to uh, Calculate uh, Tulis penuh eh Okay, here, berapa? 5660. 5660. Sorry, boleh kita klik kat sini. Ambil daripada M1. M2. Okay. Okay, so you will get 47260. This one, 3 marks. So, from M1, 1 mark. Okay, you get this one maybe 1 mark. And then this one also 1 mark. And 1 mark. Okay, money supply. And 2. Okay, for M3, just add NCD by BSN, kemudian fix deposit and other financial institution. So, yang ni, 8787. One four three hundred. So you will get. A bit of a deal. M two. And then this item. So you will get this. Also, I can write as three marks here. This one is money supply for. M3 Okay, so it's done. You will get here 10 marks 3, 3, 2, 2 Important tips is you have to remember which item for the uh, for each uh, money supply For M1, only fiat money and demand deposit by commercial bank For M2, any kind in commercial bank and for uh, M3 any kind in other financial institution, including BSN, including Agrobank, um, what, um, Discount House, KBSP Insurance also included in the other financial institu institution, which is M3. Okay, so now let's look at next tutorial from the slide. Okay, for this, also I think, it's quite simple. First, to get M1. So, from this question, the table below shows the list of money supply component in a country in the year 2013. So, paper money, coins. This one is um, fiat money, included in M1. Fixed and seven deposit in commercial bank. M2. Fits and deficit in other ba uh, banking institution, M3, current account, M1, repose, repurchase agreement, commercial bank, M2, NCD, negotiable certificate, also M2, and this one also M2. So, only one item in the M3. Okay, let's calculate. First, paper money. Paper money, 2, okay, and then coins. 
sometimes they use uh, coins uh, coins and paper money sometimes they use fiat money so if uh, fiat money you just put it fiat money no need to calculate what uh, how much is paper money and coins and then current account current account just like account semasa basically usually you have you have uh, saving account untuk current account biasanya orang business so calculation of the interest rate tu berbeza sikit berbanding saving account so current account 320 so just calculate here this one is M1 ok for M2 fixed and saving deposit so if you have fixed and saving in deposit in commercial bank your money will be calculated in the M2 So this one is M2. Okay. And for M3, just add one more fixed and saving deposit in uh, other financial institution. is it 840 so now just calculate all from M2 and So this one is M3. Okay, so that's all for A, B, and C. For narrow money, narrow money, if M2 minus M1. So here M2 132 132 two, minus M1 71150 So narrow money is 80 6082 this one is narrow money okay for broad money m3 minus m1 
so m3 1 4 0 7 2 minus n1 room 1 5 0 Okay, this one is got money. Okay, easy peasy. That's all for question 2. It's very easy actually for this part. Okay, and the last tutorial. Also similar to previous question. Yeah. M1, M2, M3, quasi money and brought near money. <coughs> so to calculate M1, coins plus paper money plus current deposit in commercial bank. So coins 8050 plus paper money 5550 current deposit 9050. So calculate here. This one is M1. For M2, negotiable certificate. Saving and fixed deposit in other financial institution is not included in included in M two. It's on M three in the M three. For saving and fixed deposit in commercial bank and Benegara certificate. So here, negotiable certificate 3650, saving in commercial bank 15050, 050, 050 and bank certificate 12050. Calculate here. Okay, this one is M2. For M3 plus saving and fix in other financial institution. Seven nine five zero. Okay, this one is M3. Quasi money. M2 minus M1. So here, M2. This one. Minus this one. So you will get this value. For brought was brought near money M three minus M one. So here M three minus M one. So that's all. All together is ten marks. Okay, so you have to check with yours. And if still do not understand, please let me know and write down in the comment. Okay, thank you. Bye.